and everybody should know that's how love goes. It's good for the soul. Oh, I got a long way to go. Ain't that stupid? Let's go. We don't want to be ratted out by this ghetto fabulous bitch. Bet I won't be a bitch when I take that board and beat you down. Okay, with it. you know what? This idiot isn't worth it. Oh. I'm going again, guys. Oh, you oh, can do it. Go again. Do it. Do it. Yeah. Yeah. Do it. Yeah. 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 He was waiting when I got home last night. He hit you. Yeah, I'll be there in a minute. What's up, Kenny? Not much. How about you? Watch it. Looking at all this ass kind of makes me feel warm. <laughs> like I'm sitting around a campfire. <laughs> and his fine friend sit up in this club like they pay right here. Look, if my husband wants to sit at some titty bar and nurse in a week Long Island, that's his business, okay? He claims it helps him relax, so I am not tripping. Come on, Amon, I'm trying to get a high score here. So am I. So why don't you put the game down and do some work? I know all about the Crusades. I said don't worry, so don't. All right. No, you're not asleep. It's cheating. Especially if a man's sitting there with wood. It's simple, Bird. If there's no penetration, it's not cheating. Oh, my. Give me a... Okay. Okay, so if I was to give another man a blowjob, oh, I'm not cheating? That would be penetration of the mouth. So, yes, that's cheating. Hand job. Mm -hmm. You know what? This is stupid. See what I'm saying? You can't even think about it without getting upset, Lem. Trying to act like you was just going there to relax. Ugh. 
I don't know how you could have thought this was going to be okay with me, Kenny. All right, you should consider it a blessing that I can still get it up after all I've been through. A blessing? You were letting that stripper rub her titties all up in your face and you're blessed? I, no, no, look, look, look. Now, I know for a fact that you have been to see men strip, so don't try to act all innocent here. That is complete. That's a check for the $48,000 that you paid me, plus interest. Hey, T, I'm sorry, but your checks have been going straight to my business manager. Mm -hmm. And I forgot all about it. I would have stopped you from sending them a long time ago. So I guess I'm supposed to say thank you for giving me back my money. Well, legally, it's my money. What about ethically? A lawyer talking about ethics. I, that's almost funny. So is the fact that you're standing at my door. Well, I wouldn't have to be standing at your door if you didn't invite me in. Well, that's not going to happen. Thanks for giving me back my money, Russell. Okay. So that's how it is. A brother comes bearing a five-figure check and gets a door slammed in his face. All right. Come in. Surprise. Hi. Mm. Oh. I'm sorry to drop by unannounced. No, are you kidding? I'm so glad to see you. Yeah. Especially after our last conversation, I wasn't sure when I'd get to see you again. Yeah, I was thinking about a prenup, and you were right. Yeah? Yeah, absolutely. Oh, baby. I'm so glad that you know that this is not a comment on how much I love you or trust you. Yeah, I know that. So, I guess we'll both have to just wait till she gets home, huh? I guess so. Mm. What's this you're waiting? You might as well wait inside. That's really mature. So, what do you want, Russell? I just want to talk. Okay. You've got four minutes. Hey. Hello. Report with. Yeah, except he didn't do any work. I told him he wasn't going to use me, so he called me a bitch. Hmm. Is that right? Yep. So I turned in my project without him. I'll get penalized a whole grade just to make sure he gets an F. I really thought we was friends, but it made me feel like a chump. Oh, wait. Now, nobody can make you feel like anything, Amon. And nobody can control your thoughts or your feelings but you. And you know you ain't no bitch, right? Right. All right. So forget about him. <clears throat> so we cool? Yeah, we cool. All right, shoot. Play the dominoes with your paw. Hey, Josefina. Hi. Did you have a good time last night? I had the best time last night. <laughs> Carlos sold two paintings. Mm -hmm. Great. And I have your earrings. Thank you very much. They look so good on you. I'm wearing them tonight. Oh, yeah? because you two are young, and Carlos is all those things. And I believe he's gonna be really successful someday. But that's not even why I'm marrying him. I just, I love him. And I have to believe that that's the right reason. That is the right reason. Thank you. There you go. Damon must be taking you someplace nice. You look very pretty. Thanks. Actually, I'm not going out with Damon. Really? He's a lucky guy. I'm going to dinner with Russell. Wait. I can't believe that you just gave me all that advice. Madame? Monsieur, welcome to Etoile. Merci. You have a dream job at Green North to take care of your family. Well, I did. Russell, what are you really doing in Chicago? I came to see you. And? And look at some property, check out some business opportunities. Sounds like you're trying to make a move. Maybe. I like Oakland, but uh, my contract's up this year and the bears have been sniffing around. <laughs> they could use some help. <laughs> Excuse me, Russell Banks, right? Yeah, right. My fiance is a huge fan. Can we get an autograph? Sure, if the uh, lady doesn't mind. Certainly. Fine. Thanks. We just got engaged.
tell your brother I said hello. I'm gonna go. Terry! Hmm? Yeah, no, I'm still here. You never did tell me if these were still your favorite.